We're checking out the sausage, egg, and cheese croissant from Burger King. Ooh, look at that grease stain. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Like, seriously, this grease stain is giving me like 90s vibes. Like, 90s grease stain vibe. This is a classic style grease stain. What is up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Full Nelson Eats A Lot. I'm your host Sarisimos. Today I've got a brand new review for you. It's a food review from Burger King. This is a sausage, egg and cheese crisp sandwich. Of course, we've got a lovely grease stain on there on the bag. But real quick, thank you to everybody who's been supporting the channel and tuning in. I do all kinds of foodie related content. So if you enjoy seeing food reviews with some style, maybe think about subscribing. Before we jump into it, I just wanna say, am I the only one who gets this many Burger King coupons? They'll send you rectangles. If you don't like rectangles, they'll send you squares. You got whole sheets of them right here. I'm literally like swimming in coupons, so many coupons. And they all don't expire till like the end of the year, so I don't know why they keep sending even more. And it's all for the same stuff. I feel like it never changes. I mean, seriously, Burger King, I know you're hurting for business. They're gonna make you eat some Burger King. They don't give a damn about no McDonald's or no Travis Scott. They got coupons for your ass. You better eat Burger King. Am I the only one who gets this many Burger King coupons? Maybe I just live in a certain zip code or something. All right, let's jump into the food. Let's get a closer look. This is the croissant, which you can see here on the wrapper. It does state that it's been a Burger King original since the year 1983. That is quite a long time. So this must have been a successful menu item for Burger King. It looks like the croissant's light and flaky, a little bit of oily butter residue on the wrapper. And it looks like it's toasted as well. Hopefully it has a slight crunch when we bite in. Well, learning a little history about the croissant, which made me work up an appetite. So let's give you a bite and see what it tastes like. Boom. All right, y'all, we got the sandwich right here. It's looking pretty good. I mean, to be honest with you, it's real simple. You see it right there. Cheese, sausage, egg, and more croissant. It does look really soft, if I say so myself. A little soft. All right, let's go ahead and try it. Mmm, that looks like a really nice bite right there. Let's bite it right here. See what it tastes like. Mmm. Wow, this is gonna be a quick review because I like it. It's simple. The ratio is on point. Let's talk about the ratio. There's not too much croissant. There's not too much sausage. Everything's in perfect balance. The cheese, the egg. The egg and the sausage both extend to the edge of the croissant. And the croissant is maybe about the same thickness as the sausage patty. And the egg is about the same as the sausage. So very equal there it tastes like a like a jimmy dean's frozen croissant sandwich that's what it tastes like it, one of those jimmy dean's frozen but better i would definitely pick this up again just quick on the go sausage croissant egg it's soft it's flaky i like that you know the egg mcmuffin if you ever had one of those that muffin it's kind of tough that muffin and then this is so soft and flaky i mean it's just like just pulls right apart it's very nice enjoyable to eat and it's got a buttery flavor to it the savoriness from the sausage is probably one of the more prominent flavors there which is good but it doesn't overpower it it just gives that saltiness and savoriness to every bite and then the eggs is kind of like what needs that kick of flavor from the sausage. So it complements. I would say for a fast food breakfast sandwich for this price, I mean, I paid four bucks. I got two of them. I got hash browns and I got a large coffee for four bucks. I mean, that's a deal. That's a deal. I'm thinking about all of that in this rating. 8.8. .8. I mean, 8.8, .8. it tastes good, it's a good value. I mean, I can't, I can't be mad at it. Low key, maybe better breakfast than McDonald's. I don't know, I'm gonna have to try more items. But that's it for my review of the sausage, egg and cheese Chris sandwich here at Burger King. I really had fun making this video for you. I hope you enjoyed. 
please like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. I do foodie content like this almost every single day, but I do switch it up from time to time. So I hope you enjoy the variety. Thanks so much for being here and I'll see you on the next one, Boom Squad.